what else is coming for you? I mean, what other projects do you have? Or because right. I know you, you are. I, have a lot of I, I wish I had more time, but uh, yeah. So, yeah, I'm also focusing now. One of the things I do is also real estate here in Miami. So, uh, between the real estate, the parties, and the collection, yeah, I think right now I'm good with ideas. But later on, I'm sure I'm, I'll always love to create new stuff and continue doing things I find interesting and fun. Okay, fabulous. You are originally from Israel, that's right? Yes. And you are living now in Miami. Mm -hmm. Okay, so where were where, where were you uh, during the lockdown and all this uh, time? I was in Miami all this time. Yeah. Miami. And and how, how, how it was for you? It was a new experience because I'm used to travel every weekend. For the last 11 years, I was on tour, and mm -hmm. from being used to being in the airport and pack your stuff and land in a city and go to a hotel and pack again and go to events, suddenly you are spending the whole time in your own house which was weird in the beginning, but then it's kind of like nice being home and sleeping in your own bed and have your own breakfast and doing your own routine. So it was really new experience, which I really like being home now. Yes, yeah, because for some people that time was very hard, very difficult, uh, even getting into depression or something. But for some people, this was a time for growing and creating new projects like you did, with the, with the, that you accelerated your, your store and everything. So it was and positive in some ways, right? I must say, yeah, in the beginning it was a bit shocking, you know, when all the parties cancelled and all the stuff and the festival cancelled, the Puerto Vallarta, the Vallarta Heat Festival. At the first it was a shock, but again, I was like, it is what it is, and you have two options. One, just stay home and get upset about everything that comes in, or build yourself and try to think out of the box uh, and study and create new stuff. That's why I did the real estate course. I studied for three months at home, every day, eight hours. I work on the new clothing collection. So, you know, life sometimes can be unexpected, mm -hmm. but about how you react to that so i choose to focus on the good thing and create something new yeah and that that's great because in life there are only two ways and <laughs> you decide which one you're gonna take right so that's fabulous and you know that you are a sex symbol for, for many for many people so of course a lot of people want to know about you, about your love life, about your... Uh, are you in a relationship right now or something? Or now I'm happy with you. <laughs> I'm single, I'm married to my work. I love that. I love being busy. I wake up early, seven in the morning every day, and I work until sometimes nine or 10. But again, because I do stuff that I like, uh, I don't see it as work, I see it as something that I just enjoy doing. So yeah, I'm single. Uh, I'm sure, you know, some people they saying, oh, I would like to find or to meet. I think things are happening very naturally. Whenever something happens, you meet someone, the energy connected and it just happened. I don't plan on things. Uh, I've been to relationship before, actually, most of my life I've been in a relationship, two years, two years, two years, two years, um, and everything happened without me planning that I want to have a boyfriend. You just meet someone that you get along, you have this good connection, you feel like, oh, I want to see him again, and it happens. Okay, so people, Ilya is single. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure a lot of, a lot of people is going to be happy to hear that. <laughs> So, well, that, that's great. Like you said, love is something that just comes in the right moment. You know? You're not close, you just come. Yeah, that's, that's right. And what, are you, what is the type of, of person or man that you like or what do you find sexy in some, some person? So I don't have a specific type. 
Uh, I never been to dating apps or stuff because I really like meet people face to face. It can be, I don't know, just walking in the street, going to the supermarket or being in an event. And it's all about, I think, it's all about the connection and the energy and, you know, from body language to the way he speak to the way you know he connect with you to the way he look at you so there is not something specific uh, obviously the first the only most important thing it's not just for dating or relationship or friendship or work it's for everything it's number one is be a good person uh, number two be real with yourself which means let's say Let's say someone is shy or someone can be insecure about something. So the, the natural reaction is to do the opposite. Show, oh, I'm super secure, oh, I'm super... No, just be yourself. I know it's hard, but I find it extremely sexy. Mm -hmm. uh, um, and this is one of, this is the two most important things. The rest coming after. Yes, so you don't like this type of uh, persons that are posing and are all the time. No, 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 no. No, that's great because, that, I mean, honesty and all these kind of things is the best, the best thing of a person, right? Mm -hmm. So that's good. And so are you planning to go uh, to Puerto Vallarta soon? Um, just for fun to... or wait yeah. to the, to the papa party? Yeah. Right now, I know it's super hot there now in the summer, but after I might uh, come back, maybe with Papa Party and to see all the papitos from Puerto Vallarta. I miss, I miss Vallarta. Yes. <laughs> it's, and are you planning uh, uh, also to come back to Madrid for, uh, soon? I was in Madrid last week. I went oh, there. Last week? Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. oh, oh. But... That's great. This is a, a city that you fell in love. <laughs> I mean, I, I've been here for one and a half year now. And yes, I'm in love with Madrid. But also I was loving, in love with Puerto Vallarta. And so, and never been in Miami, but probably soon. <laughs> so that's great. So is there something else that you want to share with our uh, readers and followers? where we can find the, the, the store, what is the... The, so, the store is, is the online store, it's called eliadcoinstore.com okay. uh, and we ship worldwide. Um, of course, whoever get our stuff, it will be great if you can tag me or the store so we can repost because we love to see our fans wearing our stuff. Mm -hmm. And I hope everybody's okay and all these crazy tough time is behind us and from now on things will be better and that's it let's let's continue to do positive stuff and spread love and it's all about that thank you for having me no no thank you thank you very much for being uh, with us for gay pb magazine so your social networks do um, you use Instagram, Facebook? Or... Yes, it's all Elliot Coin, so it will be easy to find. So everybody, you know, follow uh, Elliot Coin and go to the store eliadcoinstore.com. That's right. And thank you very much. We are so honored, and, and well, it's a pleasure to to meet you. And I hope to meet you very soon in person. And thank you very much. This is KPB Magazine. Ilya Cohen, thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.